it's Ellie and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I decided I'm going to do a night routine video since I love doing routine videos. Yeah I do. And I'm going to show you my summer night routine. Obviously I'm at home right now in my family house. Will is currently on holiday as well so he's not in this otherwise normally a lot of my night routine would be with him. But yeah I'm going to show you what my night routine is like tonight. So it's currently 5.30pm and I'm going out for dinner with one of my friends which I'm at really excited about however before I do that I need to sort out my room because it is such a mess like it's actually embarrassing so I need to sort this out before I can go to dinner and I'm telling myself I need to otherwise I just won't do it this is me being very honest and vulnerable I'm gonna show you the mess that my room is in right now it's a state let me tell you yummy yummy oh my god it's so bad it's so bad. I kind of just chucked everything out of that case and that was a big mistake. Like, why is there wrapping paper? It's giving Christmas. So, I'm gonna have a quick tidy up and sort that all out and then I can enjoy the rest of my night and go to dinner and everything and be nice and chill. Slay! So, let's get started and clean this mess. Okay guys, so my room is tidier than it was. A lot tidier than it was. It's not perfect, but it's improved. I'm gonna show you my outfit really quickly. I've been wearing this all day, but obviously I'm wearing it to dinner too. My skirt is Urban Outfitters, and my top is Hollister. And I've got my seashell necklace, and I'm not wearing hair extensions. Just thought I'd mention because you might be like, where's her hair gone? I took my extensions out. And it looks not awful. I thought it was gonna look worse than it does. I'm not too mad about it, it's just very short. It's gonna take some getting used to, but it's okay. Megan is getting some stationery. She's a stationery girly through and through. I'm buying some postage packages. Not too exciting, but because I'm selling stuff on Vinted. Looking at all the stationery and I'm like, oh, I just want to get something just for the fun of it. And I need self-control. So I'm self-controlling right now. I'm not getting anything. Okay guys, so I'm back from dinner. It was really nice and so good to have a catch up with Megan. If you remember like my old videos, there is probably videos of Megan there because we've been friends for so long. We were besties in year seven when we were 11 and now we're 21. So, oh my God, 10 years, that's crazy. We've been friends for 10 years. Slay. So it was really, really nice to have a catch up and just a good old chit chat, good old gossip. Sorry, no, it would never gossip. No, absolutely would. Overall, it was really, really lovely. And I had buttermilk chicken, which was lovely too. Anyways, so obviously now I'm home. It's around half eight already. And I don't want to have a super late night tonight. I don't really have any reason to go to bed early because it's summer and I don't have anything on tomorrow, but I don't want to be going to bed like crazy late anyway. I think what I'm going to do is I need to do some like emails and like work stuff. Work being like social media stuff like sending emails checking things and just kind of like admin is that the word for it just like making sure i've responded to who i need to respond to and all of that so i think i'm going to do that for maybe like 15 20 minutes to bring me up to nine o'clock so let's do that now and then i can kind of get into my more nightly nighttime routine if that makes sense so let's do that first <laughs> My laptop's dead. <laughs> I don't want to break your little bubble, but you got to wake up to reality. Because I can see in your eyes, your head is full of 
So I spent probably way more time than I needed to being um, a little bit unproductive then because I was going on TikTok a little bit as well. But I'm going to now start my like nighttime, nighttime routine. So I want to do a workout because I've got a lot of energy and I've done this for a couple nights while I've been at home and I'm enjoying it. It's different working out at night because when I'm at my uni house, I tend to always just work out in the morning and like actually go to the gym. I don't have a gym membership here. So it is just like home workouts, but you know what? I'm not against that. And it's just like downstairs. So I think I'm gonna do that now. I'm very excited because I do love working out. I'm gonna choose a cute little workout outfit to make myself feel all inspired. And let's have a workout. I did literally just say I'm gonna wear a cute set and then just put like a not cute outfit out, but it's okay. I'm gonna feel cute and that's what matters. Swag. Is this the best outfit you've ever seen or is this the best outfit you've ever seen? I do have workout stuff on underneath, but this is what I'm starting off in on my pink socks, so. And my short hair. Feels so weird. Let's go. <laughs> Why did I think a fun warm up would be just doing burpees? That wasn't fun. <laughs> I was gonna do like a workout workout, but I've just thought I really wanna see if I could do a side somersault. Is it safe? Probably not, but I just really wanna try. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm really close to you right now, sorry. Was I in your personal space? Sorry. I'm gonna see if I can do a side somersault. This is really random and I'm a little bit scared, but I will. YOLO. <laughs> Okay guys, so I had like a little workout but I mainly just decided to stretch because I really want to get like super flexible again because I used to be so flexible and I'm a little bit less flexible now so I want to like get fully flexible again. That was my slayer era and I'm ready to re-enter it. So yeah, that is fun and fresh but yeah, I had a good time and I feel a little bit more calm now. So I'm going to go start getting ready for bed. I really fancy though like an ice cold drink. I think that would be so nice. So I'm gonna get myself a little drink and go upstairs so we can start getting ready for bed. Okay, so um, in my PJs, oh, my phone's gone off. In my PJs, I've had a shower. My phone is going crazy, bro. What's going on? This is Gary, and Gary's a chicken or a duck. I don't really. Oh my god. So I'm gonna have to see what's going on on my phone. It's like a party over there. I look really funny right now. But I'm in my PJs. I'm all cozy and clean from the shower, but I do need to do my skincare. I haven't even took my makeup off in the shower. It's a little bit weird, but it's because I didn't want to have mascara like bleh. So I'm gonna take it off like with cleanser and in my skincare routine. I actually only recently started getting into skincare again because I spoke about this like online, but last year I had just like the worst. I don't even know what to call it. It was like hay fever mixed with skin allergies or something, I don't know. My face was so sore, it was patchy, it was bleeding, it was horrible. All summer, and so I literally couldn't do skincare, and even throughout last winter, 
whenever I tried to use any skincare, it would just flare up again, like so badly. But my skin has finally calmed down and got over whatever little phase it was going through. And I'm slowly starting to reintroduce skincare. And I'm deciding to use Simple because it's like kind to the skin and like known for being kind to the skin so that is what i'm using and i'm literally just using like a cleanser a moisturizer and another thing it's like plumping brightening something like that i don't know but it makes me feel good so so that's what we're gonna do now Ow, let's go skincare let's go it also just makes me feel so much more like calm and ready for bed when i do skincare i just feel like put together and that's always nice so bolts of lightning Pouring rain, crescent moon has taken itself far away to lay down. One more lazy dream, I can't sleep. The used to you and me, we was thicker than love. But the sky moved up and got inside of me. So my skincare is done and I brushed my teeth as well while I was there, obvi, gotta brush the teeth. I'm gonna put my hair into a little braid because someone on Instagram told me if you braid your hair before bed, it grows. TBH, I don't know how that works, but I do believe it. And I feel like other people have told me this before. So we are doing braid. I'm pretty much already for bed, apart from I need to take out my contact lenses and put my glasses on. I literally never ever do this when I film normally because I don't like wearing glasses on camera. But this is real, this is raw, this is authentic real life shenanigans so the contact lenses are coming out and the glasses are going on because i only wear my glasses right before bed and first thing in the morning i literally sat on them years ago so they are wonky and don't fit me don't like wearing glasses i don't think they suit me at all and these are my old ones i have newer ones i don't know where they are but anyway, yeah, I think the last thing I'm gonna do before I go to bed is chill on my phone for a bit and like just have some relaxing downtime. When I go to sleep, I cannot stand silence. I hate it. So I put on a podcast or a YouTube video just to help me like fall asleep and then obviously it'll turn off after I fall asleep, but I need it to help me get to sleep. But guys, that was my nighttime routine, my summer edition nighttime routine so i hope you enjoyed hope you enjoyed the vulnerability that is going on right now i do feel very vulnerable i feel like an easy target right now this is your sign to be your true authentic self maybe people will like you more maybe <laughs> But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know if you enjoyed the style of this video because I really wanted it to be kind of like a chatty, kind of just like taking you along my nighttime routine with me rather than it being like a super, super, super structured, less realistic night routine. I feel like this was very, very realistic and like what my summer nights are actually like, but I think that's good. If you're not already subscribed, please do so. Join my YouTube family. I'd really appreciate having you aboard. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy. And is there anything else I want to say? That is all for now. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.